Hello, babe. Honestly, I do not understand your newly employed housekeeper. It's not something I can speak on the phone. When you are back from your trip, we're going to talk about it. All right. Hello? Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on right there. I don't understand. What is wrong with you? Is it because I told you about the pregnancy? And I, 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 I let you in on the plans? That's why you're demanding for money anyhow? You know, you're... I am not regretting why I told you about this pregnancy. And why I let you in on this plan. No problem, just tell me where you are and I'll come to you. Now, hey, 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 listen, listen, listen up. Let this be the last time, I mean the very last time, you ask me for this again. Don't try it again. This boy is playing with me. <laughs> He's trying to rip me off. We shall see about that. <laughs> okay. This whole thing is becoming unbearable. I don't even know why she's fighting me. Is it that I'm tormenting her in her dreams or what? I don't just get it. Don't need to explain, Sui. I already know who Taurus is. Sometimes she can be so overbearing. I am sure she must have driven you to a point where you could not speak it anymore. That's why you have to talk to her like that. The brother is really trying. Coping with her assistance. Well, they've known themselves in the country school days, but I'm still surprised. Doris was never like this. She was a sweet girl, so nice. I feel maybe her university classmates influenced her. She doesn't just know what she's doing to herself. I think your brother needs to talk to her to change from her. Of those her nonsense, stupid characters. <laughs> you don't know, Doris. That's if she will listen. Let's just forget about him. He's just be with her. He should be with us. <laughs> Let me see what halal. If the thing hadn't been as the world going. <laughs> This is the morning. Wow. <laughs> now listen to me. Let this be the very last time. Ask me of money again. Doris, you are supposed to calm down. You have to be polite, knowing for you whether I have our secrets. They calm down. Doris. Doris, no shaking, cha. If you give me attitude, no shaking. But all I know, you don't turn my ATM. I will chop you. I will use you to make money. You give me attitude. And the reason. <laughs> mm. 
Listen, girl, if you ask me, I would tell you not to worry yourself at all. I mean, that guy is the nobody. Baby, you needed to have been there. If you see the insult this guy gave to me, saying that I will never see a man that will marry me, can you imagine? I, I, why would he say such a thing to you? Is that your God? <clears throat> oh, that's his plan for you not to get married, that's right? That's that is exactly what she wants. Oh my God. Let me tell you something. From the very day I saw him, I set my eyes on him. I knew that this guy was a devil sent. In fact, the devil sent him from the pits of hell. Can and you know what? I am going to do something that he will go back and tell the devil that, Oh my God, this girl is not what you think she is. Oh yes. Oh, but Dory. Well, not to worry, babe. Don't worry. Don't worry, the insult this guy got to me. That is why I came to your house, so I can cool off. Because I was, I don't to you, I was depressed. I was down. How could you say such to you? Well, what are you going to do now? Eh? What are you going to do? You know he now walks with your boyfriend and he visits there regularly. How are you going to avoid him? <laughs> I know that look. Hey, babe, you know me now. Good <laughs> morning. You know what I can do? You know me now. <laughs> babe, you know me now. But I will sort it out. Let me go where we did go. Calm down. Just calm down. A brick kiss. Okay. How do I look? Victory. <laughs> Ethan. Thank you. I think uh, you should uh, call who I find out why he has reported for duties up there. And I'll do just that soon that day. Mm -hmm. And for that day, okay. don't you think you need to drive on to ease your stress? <laughs> you, you, you know that I like driving myself. Mm -hmm. I like driving my driving is my hobby. Eh? Plenty, but I'm just concerned. No worry, don't worry. Just don't be concerned, eh? Don't be worried about me. Your dress is fine, Dad. Well, fine. Be very good. Don't worry, I think uh, it's idleness. By the time the good news of yesterday I brought comes out, you'll forget about where that. Yeah. So uh everything is the car? Yeah. yeah. We've let me go. I see you later. Yeah, you have the mind, baby. Love you, baby. We are just. Thanks. I'm a past troll. You need to walk the hair by such troll. Antonia, it has been my dream to scream, babe. So when my daddy said it, I was so happy. <laughs> well, my dear, I see no reason why you should be so eager to study abroad. You have the certificate you need. I mean, what do you need others playing two certificates for? Are you the one saying this? Not knowledge is wasted. I know, my dear. It's just that I feel it's a waste of money going abroad to study again. When you can use the certificate you have here, get a good job. Or even better still join your dad in his claim. But you think so? There is nothing like a waste of money. Mm. When money is being channeled to the right sources, it is not a waste. I'm a robot, my dad is not complete. What is it? He's just a one-year course girl. Mm. Are you sure? I don't have a problem with that. Maybe I was just looking at it from my own angle. You know, I didn't have a dad and it's just my mom children, my expenses. And I think it's time to pay her back. Just left for me to get a good job, maybe a good salary pay, and then I'll support her. You will be super proud of you. Because at least her money was not in use. Um, and don't worry, you will get a job. Amen. And get a good job. Yeah. <laughs> I think you'll get a good job. Amen. Well, I'm actually rushing to see Put 
me, sir. I could tell my daughter. Looking for number 19 Gozier Street. Number 19 Gozier Street? Yes. I I'm also looking for the same address. Uh uh. Yes. Sister. Sister, oh. old. Please go. Uh, do you stay around here? We are looking for number 19 Gozier Street. Yeah, this is the street. 19 man and money too. Yeah, it is the house. Her. Okay, please, can you... Oh, she... Sir, she lives here, but I'm sure she's not around. Thank you, my daughter. I will still call her to see if she will pick her card, couple. But if you will first, what place to tell with Dedra? Who do you want to steal? Um, I'm here to see who. Okay. I can to see Faith. Faith? Yeah. Okay. Um, Faith is a uh, hope's sister. Okay. You have been here before? No, this is my first time. And the world I've visited? Yes. Um, have you tried calling her line? I've been calling her and she refused to pick her call. Same here, I've been calling her. He has not been picking. It's alright. I think uh, you still have to call him or you give me a test message. For me, I'll be going. I'll come later. Okay, sir. No problem, sir. I already have your number from the on from the day really. Okay, day was. Hi dear. How are you? I'll find. You remember me? Why not? Your piece is the Nelson's daughter. Hope's bot. <laughs> oh, right. sorry. Oh, please, let's go inside. Oh, no, no, no. I'm actually in the hurry. I've been here for the past one hour. I actually came here with a man that was looking for you. Looking for me? Yes. But I don't keep any friends around this area, so I wonder who could be looking for me. Did he tell you his name? No. Well, but can you perhaps describe how he looks? Well, he's an advanced man, old enough to be my father. Well, I'm sure if he had something reasonable to see me about, he will come back. Yeah. Surprise to see you here. Like, <laughs> hope all is well. Maybe yes, all, yes, all is well partially. I'm here to see Hope. I'm looking for Hope. Ah. Well, he left to work early this morning. He didn't come to work. In short, my father asked after him. That's why I'm here. Because he was supposed to pack into our house fully today. Do you mean he didn't come to work? Yeah, I, I, I know he was supposed to because he, he left early this morning with some of his clothes and I, I, I just felt he was going to stay through the week, then probably come back weekend. Though he didn't tell me that, but I just felt he didn't come to work. Are you sure he's still not angry over the fight he had with Doris? Maybe that's why he doesn't want to call. No, no, he, no, not at all. But what is it? If he doesn't want to work, he would have told me. I'm sure he doesn't want to tell my father because my dad is the boss. But I'm his friend. He would have told me that he doesn't want to work again. I've been calling him and he's not taking my calls. He's not taking your call? Yes. I... 
Sorry, one minute. What's it? He's not picking. Uh, it, it's actually a rank, but the call dropped. I told you, something is not right. Something is wrong. Hope does not be like this. Okay. Uh, a strange man comes looking for me. And now, Hope is not... I, I think so too. Yeah, yeah. Doris, Doris, I hope what I am thinking is not true. Oh, are you sure that man that came to see Faye does not have any information about Hope's disappearance? Ah, uh, that's true. We then should call her. <laughs> Hello, Faye. Faith, please, have you gotten any information about Hope's disappearance? Not yet. Please, immediately you get any information, let me know. Thanks. Okay. Bye. I don't know why you guys brought me here. I don't know why you brought me here. I've told you if it is plot that you want, Take it for free. I'm not asking for anything. Don't give me any money. Just take it for free and allow me to go. Can I clear that? Don't let me know until you call him out. You are just a cop in any house. What's wrong with you? Are you mad? Still, I need fire one more year from you now. Is it because I'm not giving you a single city? Eh? Are you mad? I'm not mad, though. I'm not mad, but no verse. If you guys brought me here for ransom, it's going to be very hard, though. Because you can't even get it from anyone. I'm telling you, for three days now, I've not even eaten. Talk more of asking me for ransom. There's nothing to give you. I don't know shishi you won't get from me. Because I don't have it. No, Mr. Man, listen. When we want ransom, to release you, you will know. And now, keep quiet and observe. One more word from you again. Man. Really? I saw a big day. Get you going. Can I can I have my phone, please? Which one? If I yell in any way from your mother, I will smash you for floor. Can I play for you? Match and wear match is full. Sorry, sorry. sorry. Stores in. Sorry, sorry. Let me hear one more for me. You know, you know how sorry you are now. One sense. Come on, guy. Hello, Kevin. Yes. Doris has a hand in Hope's disappearance. I am very sure about what I'm talking about. See, you need to see the way she was talking to him the day they met. Ah, it was so hot. She was insulting him. I saw so much hatred in her voice. And now definitely she will lie about it. Are you expecting her to admit it? She, she will lie about it. You said what? That Dolly said I did not call her. No, please. I called Dolly somebody and she refused to pick my call. I even had to text her. She did not even reply. And well, it's, it's obvious now. She will not want to reply because she knows the game she's playing. That's it. Yes. I wouldn't have just started concluding. I did mean she picked. At least I would have asked her first before coming to you. But she did pick, so that's why I had to tell you first. 
Yes. I am 100% sure that Doris, 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 your girl, has a hand in the disappearance of hope. Quote me anyway. Really? Okay. No problem. But what is it again? This I'm swinging it. Are you okay, boy? Gosh, um, it's you thought it was Clifford. I know, because you look pissed off. Is Clifford getting you upset? If it was Clifford, it would be better. Oh, oh, I see. It was Doris. Your brother's girlfriend. Because the way he saw her drove past me at the gate, it just looked so, so abnormal. That girl just said she did Chris. She thinks that I always she did Chris. Imagine that girl had the gut to come into my father's house to go and warn me. Because I sent her a text message, call on text message. Why did she not pick a call? Because I called her straight one day and she refused to pick a call. Because she knows she has a hand in her disappearance. How about what it is? You should not have said that to her so quick now. But why didn't she pick a call? Do you know if she was with her phone at the point? Oh, so where did she see the message for? TV. Oh, peace. I understand how you feel right now. But my point is that you shouldn't have sent that kind of test to her. You don't even know if she have an idea of what you're saying. Huh? You think so? Yes. I know so. And she's your friend. And as such, she's also your uh, brother's girlfriend. So please just take it as you can, can you? Oh, my friend, that's her way of life is not lines. Calm I'm... down, paste. Topo. She will definitely change, and I know she will. Who? Tells. That proud girl. Who proudness allow her to change? Please, please. Please, my love. Calm down, I'm here. I am suspecting that something is definitely going on between them. I mean, the way she was supporting him, something is going on between them. What's it called, Simi? Eh, let me call the boy now, fine boy now. Now I'll call Simi them, I beg. But by the time we are, by, by the time I am done with them, eh? By the time I am done with him, eh, he won't know what he. Come, come, uh, Nkechi, the fact that we are friends doesn't make you a detective. Know your boundaries, eh? You hear? Just know your boundaries. I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, my friend, please. Hey guys, what's hard to now? Why are you guys keeping me on hostage here? Eh? Allow me go. Tell me go. You think so? After you've made yourself an enemy to someone? Who are we talking about here? Who be this one? Who are you to interrogate us? You can't mind. Gross, no verse. No beside to interrogate you. I'm so sorry. Uh, who are being now? Uh, am I stupid to interrogate you? Am I mad? Not possible. Uh, I'm, I'm only asking to know the person that said that I've offended him or her so I can apologize to the person. Mr. Man, horse! I said horse!
don't worry. The person that ordered us will get church mind. If not, we would have left a mark on your body. What the world do? We would have, have removed everything on your, you know, on your, on self Everything would be out by now. Flare and forward. Right here, Captain Bullshit, the cup fire. Funky. Thank God, though. You guys are so nice. Eh? Thank God he didn't beat me. With that. See, people will this is money. Eh? Don't go finish. You never want to chop. Well, now I'm going to you, Shah. Well, Simon, you, you can't trust anyone these days. Don't use the law if you before poison this food. You see? <laughs> Wait till top. Eh? See this man. Wait till they top. Poison. So the reason you have not touched your food is because you think there's a poison in it. I wonder. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> hey. Okay, sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. No, Charlie, there's a poison in it. Sorry, sir. So. No, let me have it. Then I thought that you will know there's no poison. Oh, sorry. Oh, you think if we want to waste you, we need poison to do that. Eh? Oh, sir. We want to waste you. Is it not the easiest bottle on boss or head? Sorry, sorry, sir. Now wash your hand and join me. I can wash your hand. You, you stick them out. Hear from the man who came to look for me. Oh, which man? I was told the man came looking for me earlier today. Okay. And that uh, he waited and waited. Then he had to leave because he couldn't wait anymore. And you have no knowledge of his ID? How will I know who he is when I don't have a picture of what he looks like? Whoever the person is that came to deliver that message, the person should come and give this true, true description of the person to you. Well, she actually did. Okay. But I still cannot place... I don't know. But come to think of it, what if Hope was arrested by the police? I don't think it is the police, because if it is, they would have called you before now to tell you that your boyfriend is in their custody. He is my friend and not my boyfriend. <laughs> I have told you that severally. Hey, cut thou, babe. You the parallel. It's not what I actually meant, okay? It's okay. Uh, okay, your male friend and not the other one. It's way. fine. It's okay. I'm just, I'm just worried. I'm just worried about him. I don't even know where I can go look for him. I don't, I, I don't even know much about him in the first place. So where would I go? Where, yes, can I search for this guy? And you said you didn't have his mom's contact? No. Come on. I told you how I met her. I told you how, everything, including how, everything that led to me bringing him to my home. The black said this guy gets some kind of enemies with a trailer mode. And he's not even aware. That could be true, but it doesn't stop me from worrying. Feel relax your mind. I think I know what to do at this point in time. Yeah, chill. Look, look at this whole hood. Now we get this area now. Eh? I am going to carry out an underground investigation. Find out who this man really, really is. Why he came to look for him and how he got to know your place. Hello, things. Good afternoon, Wes. How are you? Fine, Sophia. Welcome. You heard me. That man did not come for you. He came for hope. That I am certain about. I am sure of that one. Okay? But relax. I'll get back to you. Now, me now, this area now, my. Don't worry. I will see people, I will see men. Thank you. Thank you, Sophia, and I'll chill out. Are you saying that hope did not come today at all? Yes, Dad. 
I tried calling him, his number was switched off. My brother, don't worry, he'll come tomorrow. How do you know he's going to come tomorrow? You've not even established contact with him. My instinct told me. But this is disrespectful. How could he take a day off without even, you know, bothering to turn it or even getting permission? And I come to think that he just started a job not quite long ago. That he... Let's not conclude yet. You don't know why he exempted himself from work. Maybe something came up. Let's wait till tomorrow, then we'll hear from him. Well, if he doesn't come tomorrow again, then he should bother not coming at all. Because that himself sucked. Eleven Google Seven Official. Hello? Peace. Any news? Oh, not here. Pause while I was even calling you to know if there's any news. No. Oh, I mean, I'm, I'm truly confused. I don't, know, I don't know where to find him. I don't know what to do. Also, I'm as confused as you are. You know, I wanted to go report in the police station earlier. But on a second thought, I said, okay, let me just wait till tomorrow before doing that. Okay, help him here. Oh, cool to think of it. But the man that came with you should have some information about him. Don't you think so? If you think so, do you think, uh, how are we going to see him now? You know what, you should all go far because maybe he will come back looking for you. No, no, I'm not going anywhere. With Swain, these guns. Um, the thing now is that my dad is so furious. Hey, he's angry. Like I've just been busy defending him before him, but I don't know, I don't even know what to say to him. He said if he doesn't come tomorrow, that he's going to sack him. It's okay, Sha. Just take care of yourself. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Okay, bye. It's okay, Sha. Just take care of yourself. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Yeah, bye. How am I supposed to tell Faith that I am suspecting Doris in this case? Ah. I won't tell her. Let me just look for a better answer to believe what I've been. Yeah. Huh? Who is that strange man that came looking for me? I've told him to stop calling and calling, yet he keeps bugging me.
how are you? <laughs> oh, you are up so early. Good. You are enjoying a milk. Oh, I have to. It's well. Okay. You mean all this is that been going on and we as the head of the family did not know? <laughs> what kind of excuse are you making? For? Are you trying to cover them? Look, look, look. It's okay. There's no problem. I am driving now. And I, w I will call you back and everything will be taken care of. I don't see the reason why I should be there as the head of the family and this type of thing is going on and, I, and you will hear it from me. Okay. Okay. You know, I just want to many call you back and continue. Hey, how are you? I'm fine. Welcome. I've been here for that um, other house help. No news yet. We've not had anything to come in. This is terrible. What could he need at all? I'm sure Trill fell on his head. I'm sure because he doesn't still win peace. He's a that's what that's the way he decides. Why would he mess up? He doesn't just respect himself. Are you here to mock him? Or you have something to confess? Confess about what? About what? Please don't, don't, don't start. Please don't even start. Peace, please. Or oh, like seriously. Yeah, like seriously. Are you trying to tell me that you don't know anything about his disappearance? Excuse you the hell out of me. No. Are you? Really? You want to accuse me? Huh? Is that what you're trying to do? Well, that's the truth. That's the truth? Yes. Because how would you explain the bitterness you make him go through in this house? How? You are always insulting him. Always making you feel less of himself. Okay, since you suspect me this much, why don't you report me to the police? What are you waiting for? Oh, like, serious? Yes! After that, you pointed into the police long ago. You've not for the rest of the alphabet. You've not had any respect by anybody. You don't even respect it. But what are you reporting about? I don't know about people like a compressor. Oh, that's not. Don't worry, you're acting compressor. Oh, it's not. I'm just trying to look at the habits that people for that. How do you be for yourself? I mean, you can't mean it. Stay hands. You think you did them like this? You see? You see? I don't know what you're wishing for to the poor. Wait. But you don't have to wait for my permission before reporting her to the police. This piece I catch you. So this is how you disrespect my fiance in my absence. What are you saying? You know, when you called me and explained everything on the phone, I thought you were being reasonable. But walking in here, I'm seeing a different thing. So you are the one giving this guy's impression to insult my fiance? My God has vindicated me. Thank you, Lord. You have vindicated me. So you just concluded without hearing from me. Well, what else do I need to hear? 
They told me everything on the phone. This is so wrong. Hmm? You have to accord me that respect. Peace. My love, my, my sweetheart, do you know, she actually, she actually told the cook and the gate one to always insult me. That's what she does since you left. I have so far. Doris, we will give back to the Kulanya. And then, yes, we will sign to one. What a liar. And then, what you know? enough, 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 enough of this. What you said, both. What, sir? What about sad? What about the rest of What is enough? So, all this we are going on on the label. Wait not for your mom who called me for us. I wouldn't have known anything about. All, all, all of you were waiting for things to get out of hand for being my notes. They had disappointed, highly disappointed. You're so sorry, Dad. I was waiting to hear from the man I met him at his place and he said if I had any permission for me and that big I'll talk to you and so fine. Then uh, how come you accuse Doris wrongly about anything? Because she said she'll go to get tricky. So <clears throat> Yes, I said that. But I said those words out to Andan. I didn't mean them. I you know it. Really? But you've been bullying him since he came met him here. Bullying him? He's been the one insulting me, sir. He insulted me. The first time we met, he's, he told me that no man will ever get married to me. He said it. And since that day, he has been making my life unbearable. He caused this whole thing. Hope will not insult him for just no reason. And Doris will not just pick a fight without you stepping on her toes. And be careful. Why didn't you call me to tell me about all, all these things? I, I thought you were aware of that. But I was aware and uh, I didn't do anything. I deliberate not to edit. That's what you said. And you, Mr. Fixie, who can handle everything, Triple that. You know that. Don't. That me. Do not that. Even if I was aware, you should have called me to tell me things. Instead, you called your mom, who is far away overseas. When I, your father, is here, right here in Nigeria with you. Forgetting that you, I am the man in, in authority, I am the one in charge, and your mother acts under my authority. It's servant like this. I'm sorry, she did that. There are words that are implicated. There are words that you're not supposed to use when you are upset. Because such words will be used against you when the time comes. The issue of hope is one that have to death very serious. About the extreme This is a good one. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> that every. So you came with Sophia. I hope all is well. All is well, my dear. <laughs> she was the one that actually brought us back to your gate yesterday. Uh, Sophia and I, you? Eh, uh, close me all. The maiden was coming for my errand, and at first the man mentioned hope, but it told him I don't know anybody by that name in this area. It was later the man mentioned your name and the place you live, and I brought them here. Hope there's no problem. No, not at all, dear. I was just wondering who could have come check on me without my consent. But he said he had been calling the server, picking up his calls. Oh. Wait. What time did you say you met him? I think 9 to 10, if I'm not mistaken. 
it's okay. But sorry, dear. Can you somehow describe him? Yeah, of course. He's somehow tall, no fair. What do you feel like that? It's okay, dear. Thank you. All right. Oh, take care of yourself, man. Huh? Okay. Bring up to your mom. Okay. Bye. Bang. From her description, do you actually have an idea who this person is? Uh, uh, there was actually someone who kept calling and calling. Okay. But I, but I ignored him. And it was around the same time she just told me that he came looking for me. And from her description, I think I have an idea who that person is. But there's just something that's not ha adding up. Like, how did he even manage to get my address? Uh, what's the man? Is this someone I know? is full of ups and downs today you are up tomorrow you could be down trials will come temptations will come in this life's journey oh some people will walk against you they want to see you fall to see your downfall but you must try Try to stand tall so that you don't fall. Oh, 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 oh. I was very happy about what you said to me on the phone. Uh, give me Jeep now. Well, I needed to have been there. Yeah. My man stood by me. I knew if Kelvin was around. Huh? All those nonsense wouldn't have happened now. You wouldn't have allowed them to do that bad nonsense to me. Yes, no. Wait, too. Let me understand what you're saying. You mean the sister could not say anything hmm. in front of her brother? She couldn't say anything. At first, she wanted to run her mouth. Mm. But, bro, still, I said, shut up. Shut up your mouth. She quiets her mouth. Only says, girl. But see, um, Doris, listen, try not to get the odds with this girl. You know she's your friend's only sister. I mean, you're crying out loud. You guys are supposed to be like best of friends and not any. Well, my darling, we both come from two different lifestyles. I'm of the upper class. She chose to mix up with the poor people. Well, I cannot bring myself down to the slums. I can't do that. Girl, you know I'm class. Mm. I'm the word class. We come from two different class. Okay? She chose to mix up with the poor people. I chose to keep it really What's the way? You know, yeah. you don't understand. I cannot <laughs> mix this now. I cannot mix up with these people from mm. slums. I cannot. I know. I mean, you don't even know how I feel. Mm. I feel great and victorious, girl. Mm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. Uh, hey, babe. How far for the guy in Matana? Any good news about him? Mm, maybe today. If not, say, I just use my church hat for giver. Mm. And Kelvin, father, puts mouth for the matter. I wouldn't have forgiven him, but you know what? I just wanted to listen to him and just, just forgive him. Nothing much. I changed my mind. Okay? Hmm. We cannot talk, oh, you know, if I talk now. <clears throat> you go say I don't start again, Kichi. Don't start. Look at what is it? Keep my mouth shut. I'll pull your lashes. <laughs> I'll just leave your lashes. What is it? Tell me, I'll beg. Uh, except if you tell me you won't get angry, no go vex. I beg if you don't want to talk about it, then why did you bring it up? I you can not doing this thing. No, when you are now, no, I will act. Let me let me tell you before you start the parrot. Did you know where the guy was? Like, did you have any idea about the guy? Wait, there, I'll catch it. Hmm? 
Did I pay you to investigate me? Of course not. Why would you say that? Why would you ask me that? I mean, you you promised never to ask me such question again. I don't understand. You say, why you ask me? That's why I do want to ask you. You said, okay, ask, ask, ask. Please, now I won't keep quiet. I beg, I beg. Auntie, where, where, where? Uh, Let us go. Oh yeah, now let's go. No vex. Sorry. Good morning, young lady. Good morning, sir. Uh, please, do you stay around here? Oh, no, sir. I don't go. Uh, oh. I'm looking for Bozier Street. I'm sorry, sir. I don't live around here. Maybe you should ask someone who lives around the Disney neighborhood. No, no, sir. Sorry. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. How silly am I? I was here yesterday. Why did I miss the road and me? I'll greet you, sir. Do you live around here? Yes, I live around here. Please come in and help me locate uh, Engineer Gozier Street. I don't understand. I should come in. I, I, I'm not a killer. What are you doing? No, I'm not even thinking towards that side. I, your face is familiar. I think I've met you before. Are you not the man who gave me money somewhere at one hotel like that? Oh, yes, I remember. <laughs> How are you? Wow. So thank you so much for the other day. No, it's my pleasure, my brother. It's my pleasure. Wow. Okay, you say you're going to go. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Number what? Number 19. From the 19, number 19. Okay. okay, where exactly do you want to see there? Yeah, um, I'm looking for Faith. So, so, sorry for asking. Who is she to you? Oh. She's a family member. You ask as if you knew her. Uh, yes, she's my neighbor. Does she know you're coming? Uh, no, 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 no. I was there yesterday. She wasn't around. Though the route I took yesterday is different from the one of today. That's the reason I miss my route. So I was calling her all the time and she's not picking her call. I don't know why she's not picking her call. Are you sure you, you, you called her real phone number? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm very sure. Zero is zero two two five eight. Two two five five. You're right. That's our phone number, sir. Okay, let me take you there. It will in line ya dimma. Hope is a good thing to have. When there is life, there is hope. With hope you can cope. Don't give up hope. One day you will succeed. Succeed. You don't give up hope. One day you will succeed. Succeed. Succeed, echi ihe gadema. Succeed or oh, succeed, echi ihe gadema. Life is full of ups and downs. Today you are up, tomorrow you could be down. Trials will come, temptations will come in this life's journey. Oh. Some Wait, what happened? Your your number has been switched off. And why? Where did you meet him? I said, read my own case. Forget about it. We'll talk about that one later, okay? You have a visitor here. He said that he was here yesterday, but couldn't find you. But that was not the question I just asked you. Where did you meet him? He missed his way. So he saw me on my way home. And uh, he asked me of our street and described you. So I told him I know the person. Well, here we are. Oh, sir, is there any problem? There's no problem, my son. You can go now. Why do you thank you so much, eh? It's okay, sir. So I live here. I'll be inside. Let me allow you guys to talk. It's all right. This 
Oh, 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 you should bring some different I don't know. Be right. Where is it? Belly and I said, do fast and bring it to the guest rooms. Guest room? Yeah. Why did you say he should take it to the guest room? 